okay we have created uh, this contact list the menu i have given invoicing vendor and these are the field selected name mobile phone email city and country and publish it now refresh now refresh the page we have refreshed the page and uh, this menu is linked into invoicing and then vendor so here is the contact list okay so contact list wizard appeared so we can download this list in pdf and excel as well so this is in the pdf contact list so you can see over here the contact list and then uh, united states okay and uh, then into the excel print excel okay so the excel list has been downloaded you can see the complete contact list now we can also create a, a report with the master detail record so let's create another one sales orders list so here the model sale order we mentioned the sale order okay so sale order let's wait for it uh, first of all we will add the fields so here i will add uh, the name field then uh, sale order number and then the customer number this one is the customer id and then the order uh, for the customer we need to uh, provide the link field that is the name okay so i have given the name field and then go into there and uh, here order date so this is the order date i have selected this one for the order date and save it now let me check where we will uh, we will attach this one so in the orders so orders we will select sales and then orders menu we will add this report so here orders so i have it. select this one sales order save it now i want to also add some line items of the sale order detail so here we will add the line item which will the sale order line so it has been selected sale order line okay order reference field okay save it now the line items field we need to add so here is the icon i click over there and we will add some lines the product uh, okay let me go with this one search more and here we will select the product uh, this one is the product ID link field is the name field so the name field I have mentioned the name field and then the description that is name field okay display name and then I will add the quantity quantity this one is the quantity field and then i will add the price the price unit i have added this one and then i go with the total okay this is the price subtotal or the total whatever so i have added these fields and then confirm this one so the line item fields also has been added okay now i want to add some parameters to ask for or get the input from the user okay so here i will add customer okay contains operator which operator i will use the contain and here i will select uh the partner okay partner id will be compare okay and then uh from date 
okay greater than equal which one the order date field order date and then to date okay less than equal and then also the order date okay I have mentioned this one and uh, from that let me from date okay to invoice I'm going to add in the two invoice and then publish it okay go over here and refresh the page okay go into the sales and to invoice there is a sale order sale order list okay open this one you can see here now the three parameter is available for the input for the record filtration so here we will select customer i have selected the customer and print pdf so you can see there is a no data is available because there is no uh, data for the anita so we will select the gemini to invoice sale order list okay Gemini furniture print PDF okay so you can see the records uh, sale order uh, 16 and then 14 one order at one page 14 13 and 12 so there are 13 pages so we apply now the filter let's say from 15 to 26 and apply pdf okay now the nine page is there so from date to date is applied now you want to multiple customer selection so you need to make some changes go into the report builder sale order list unpublish it in the parameters you will apply that multiple list and when you will apply the multiple list the operator will change automatically to the contains okay save it and then publish it it has been published okay so uh, it has been published now go back to report builder refresh the page and click on the report builder now uh, uh, go into the sales and to invoice contact list and you can see it has been appeared for the selection of the multiple here we will select uh, uh, we will select Azure interior deco addict and uh, then Gemini furniture and select this one the three customer we have selected and click on the print PDF so you can see okay okay the report has been downloaded the 16 pages appeared so this order uh, the quotation uh, doesn't have any lines okay the next sale order 16 and so on all the orders list is available here so uh, so this is the report builder here you can create any uh, report on any of the model any of the data thank you